We are on on the mic. On the mic. On the mic is on. On the mic is on. So I'll stop cursing out whoever I was cursing out. <laughs> Oi. Well, it's it's my memory. It's getting worse. You want me to my stuff? It's getting worse. Well, it's certainly not getting any better. Well, I was going to say, you're doing fine. We're not getting any better. That would have been nice. See, I can't even remember who was doing it. What happened to my help? Stop the help! You know, here I sit all by myself. Let me tell you, five people arrived today to stay overnight. And they all started to cook dinner in the kitchen and the stove quit. So they've carried all the food over to the guest house. And they're cooking over there, but I hope they bring it over here. Because I haven't even got anybody to do mail call. Because Steve is diddling in the other room. And he's here. So there's a lot of people here, but... Here I sit all by myself. <laughs> I don't got anybody to talk to. I just sit here and just all by myself. Ta -da! <laughs> <laughs> all by myself sitting. There. <clears throat> you want one of these too? Hi, well you could use I that. No, I can use the table if you need that. You can use that. I'm gonna start opening. Hope you get there eventually, right? Oh, good. I'll catch up. Okay. This I'll one is from Cheryl Bishop. Oy vey. Perkesky? Oy vey, where's that? Pennsylvania. Oy vey's in Pennsylvania? Oy vey's in Pennsylvania. I had no idea. The Jewish side of Pennsylvania. <laughs> when I was a little kid, remember the you show McKee? I was little once, yeah. Remember the show McKee's Navy? Yeah. Remember the, 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 um, the Japanese prisoner they had, Fuji, always used to say, oy vey. So when I was little, I always thought it was Japanese. Oh, so <laughs> when someone told me it was Jewish, I was like, no. Oh my. <coughs> okay. Mine. You really make special service names. Okay, we'll do that. Oh, he's so cute. Baby. Pass him on. Says anonymous. 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 So we did that. So she wants to stay anonymous? Is that what you're saying? The goddamn thing we <laughs> Okay, we have Judith, okay. Carol, Toledo, Ohio. Sending Easter wishes. Mail on 417. <coughs> wow. Oh, there's somebody. Hello. Uh, they they're cooking. Yeah, they're they're going to bring there right now. We've got Mary's here. See that? They're going. Oh, they're so going. Much. Are they going to feed us over here? No, they're bringing the food up here. Oh, that'd be good. They're bringing the food up here. I'm going to get a lead. You're going to get a leash for the food? Poor. She's going to walk it up. Oh, walk it. <laughs> yeah. Okay. That's exactly hey, right. Judith it's Carol. really rare. <laughs> Toledo, Ohio. Judith Carroll. Ohio. Okay. Wishing you all and your very talented crew a happy Here's Easter. Here's Misha. Here's Misha. She hi, wants Misha. to say oh, hi. Go. Go 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 little little dog body. following you in the rear. Don't let him. Okay. Oh, okay. Got it. Oh, they that scared you. What oh, they're going to do? It's okay. You have a great group of new puppies from Misha and Jasper. Ready to be the nucleus of another great service dog lottery. Lots of people with balance problems will be helped in future with these fuzzy babies. Been watching the cam since June of 12, when Cookies and Cream and Jasper had their litter. Especially loved Willow and Lola and Perry, along with Mia and Ebony and Roxanne. During the years, I've learned so much from the Daily Doggy and on explore about training animals. I like watching how the donkeys enjoy their life there on the farm. I couldn't let them out today. I just couldn't stand it. No, I. there's too much around. Couldn't let who what out? I couldn't let the donkeys out to graze because every section that I could fence off had a big thing of fertilizer already spread. Oh, okay. So I had to, they couldn't come out. Please use this check wherever is needed. I'll be that in. 
be watching again when another Bella and George team win national honors or some fantastic write-up in the paper or someone's TV show. Keep up the good work for everybody. Keep your eye on Bella and George. They're they're out all the time. Yeah. They're, they're yeah. out all the time. And we have Mary, Southington, Connecticut. That, that Southington. Katie and Milo are here. Get them over here. Yeah. Hi. <laughs> Hi, Milo. Katie's going to come back and volunteer on Saturdays. Oh, cool. All right. Maybe the baby's at home. <laughs> you're you're <coughs> so lucky to be part of, well, you know, you were here. It's part of the Saturday crew. Just, yes. It's an honor. <laughs> right. Right. Because she leaves the kid home. Leaves okay. the kid. Good. Here we go. I used to be indecisive, but now I'm not so sure. Okay. If I agreed with you, we'd both be wrong. Now that I know, I use that one. Since life travels faster than than sound, some people appear bright until you hear them speak. Hmm. Since life travels, I don't say that one. Last thing I want to do is hurt you, but it's still on my list. Oh, wow. I have a new hairstyle today. It's called I Tried. <laughs> <laughs> I always carry a knife in my purse just in case there's a candy, a K candy. <laughs> That's cute. Thank you. Okay. This is Sassy Bell. <coughs> Carly and his staff in honor of Mises, 12 healthy, adorable musicians. I'd like to buy 12 chicken breasts. He was giving her his sorry. approval. Whatever it turns <laughs> up, I'm having nothing to do. <laughs> I went that road twice. I'm sorry for the aggravation caused by some difficult, miserable people. Let us know when you need to start a legal defense fund. In the meantime, here's a small donation for a summer intern program. Did you hear that over there, intern? Intern. Bye. Oh, sorry. You didn't even hear that. No. This, this person made a donation for the summer intern program. Isn't that nice? That's nice. Okay. In case you have any thoughts, it comes back in the summer. Where is it? Name, name, name. That's Sassy Bell. I don't know why you know it, but there's a sticker at the bottom. That's Sassy Bell. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> okay, so we go to Harold Wanda. I might already got it. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> you just like to get me all mixed up. You're right. Okay. <coughs> this is Harold Wanda. Did I tell you that? Tell me what? I didn't tell you apparently. <laughs> Otherwise you'd have known. Harold and Wanda. Harold and Wanda. In our growing community we are all familiar with construction zones. They're not pretty, convenient, or comfortable. They may even be dangerous. But construction is also absolutely necessary for growth. In a similar way, no matter how much it may seem that we like to have it all together, every one of us is incomplete, needing growth and maturity at some level. All of us are under. What are we reading off of? <laughs> I don't know what it is. <laughs> to meet where you are and construct you into a more complete person. <coughs> oh, I see. Okay, this is from Your Life Church. So I see. It's a church thing. Oh, I was going to say, I thought maybe it was equating the, the growth nourishment value of food with <laughs> personal growth or construction well, or something. Who knows? who knows? Thank you, Harold and Wanda. Keep, keep us guessing. What is this? Network for good. Oh. 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 Seems to me they collect money. Yeah. All kinds of... Well, that was an argument I had with today. Uh -oh. Here you go with this. You can well, thank it. you. <coughs> There's nothing on it. Okay. Network for good. Ten dollars. We'll do that. I don't know who it's from. Norton. Please keep this check stub handy if you are ever... Uh, Maureen Turgeon. That's who this is from, apparently. Network for good. Okay, well I'll put that in here. <laughs> oh, really. There you go. Well, thank you. You're welcome. <coughs> Belmont Spring. Now that is a bill. Let's move the file. <coughs> oh. Sandra Stevens, Foxborough, Mass. 
You should try speaking to right. You should, my. You should try speaking to Watson in in Dutch because he'll probably understand you. Mm -hmm. Why would you speak to him in Dutch? That one, right? She's from the Netherlands. Oh, she's from the Netherlands. Yeah. Well, the dog is Dutch. Where is he from? Denmark. That's close. <laughs> <laughs> Across the water. <laughs> Sandra Stevens. Hands across the Fox water. Of Foxboro, Mass. There Fox you go. Mass. Have that one. That's Del Mar. Hands across the sky. This is for chicken bricks. Okay. Hi to all. Glad the cameras like. I'm glued to the cameras like so many others. This will be my second litter. And I'm hooked. <coughs> Crazy Acres is a magical place. Thanks to you all. The chicken bricks. Two chicken bricks, please. Be well. Sandy Stevens. Okay, so that goes in the chicken brick department. What's that? D. Well, I can't. It's so hard to own the bill, so we just do digital whiteboard instead. Of. Totally makes sense. Yeah. Works for me. What? Are you, who? <laughs> Are you ready to pay What? Who? Just a minute. I'm working on it. You look inside. Have a wiki. Oh, Hi, this Dee. check is for 20 chicken bricks. Whoa. Thank you, D. Okay. D. And she's got her address on that, so that goes in here. And then that goes in here. <laughs> Mailing and shipping manager, United States Post Office. Uh oh, you're in trouble. We want to hear from you. <laughs> Your feedback. We have one of those machines, but somehow we don't have it correct. We don't have it right. Oh, oh God. Machine. Here we go. Crispy bacon. <laughs> this Crispy person sends me every bacon. day, every week, uh, <laughs> with a different name on it. Crispy bacon. Crispy, that's a good one. It is a good one. I like that. Why didn't we think of it? Uh, There you go. Thank you. Simply start. Oh, simply stated. <laughs> whoever this person is got a problem. <laughs> I tried sniffing Coke once, but the ice cube got stuck in my nose. <laughs> I like this person. <laughs> I don't know who it is, but it's okay. <laughs> Oh dear. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> wow. Oh, <coughs> Peoria, Illinois. This is that bunch of women who who had a party and sent us a whole lot of money. A bunch of women had a party? They did. They had a they big party. They didn't send party. us any pictures? <laughs> no, they, I don't know what they did here. Oh, there you go. I watch. There you go. This? Oh. Hello again. One straggler came over the weekend adding to WoW's donation from our card party. Bless you all. That's from Winnie. Wonderful. This card came from a set I purchased from Bella's sister, a budding photographer. Oh, nice. Bella's sister has cards out. <laughs> GMB Photography. She's a good photographer. Yeah, she is good. Was well, that fun? You want to hold that up and show everybody? That would be a good thing. Lisa Cole, Stratham, New Hampshire. He's been having a wonderful time with the yuppie puppy. He's thrown up twice. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> can you figure that out real quick? Yeah. Watson, go easy there, Bob. You're going to check the, uh, the envelopes, aren't you? Good fellow that you are. I forgot who it was. Lisa Cole. Oh, there you go. Congratulations to Misha and the other the 12 musicians. Way to go. It's great to see Misha doing so well with so many puppies to care for. And thankfully, she has a service dog project team to help. A great group of future service dogs. Lisa Cole. Isn't that wonderful? Thank you very much. Thank you, Lisa. General fun. Well, isn't that 
we found a lot of a lot of people liking the number twelve. All right, big boy, that's it. You shut off. I think we're gonna shut them off. Put the bucket on top. You shut off. You shut off. Excuse me. Once you get sick. There you go. That's all for now. You can have some more later. And why did you do that? There we go. <coughs> This is Planned Parenthood. Oh God, I don't know. Okay, I did all that. I don't have any boxes. Do I? Did I do it? Was it yesterday's box? Was it yesterday? I don't know. Is it open? Laura Ferron? Yes, that was yesterday. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> he, he is so lackadaisical. That's why I want to take them tomorrow. Tomorrow, oh, you're, oh, you're going to tomorrow we're going into a neurological conference. Yeah, uh, Grace was telling me about it. Yeah, brain, brain, or, brain stuff. Brain stuff or something. Well, they have us there for <coughs> what we do with MS and Parkinson's. Are you actually doing something there? I'm going to be there. Well, no, I understand. That's enough. That. But were you like presenting or doing anything? I forgot. <laughs> They're giving us a table and, and things like that. Oh, really? Okay. And an extension cord. <laughs> an extension cord. That's a lot in one of these places. Usually are you, you have to pay a hundred bucks for the extension cord. Are you bringing... Dogs. A laptop? Like to run a video? Yes. Okay. The one that Betsy's got. Oh, good. There you go. See? That's why I'm asking. Awesome. That's great. So, tell us a little more about it. <laughs> Brain stuff? Where you, where you go, it's a neurogi neurological thing. That, neurological stuff? It's something about memory. <laughs> well, it's down in Boston, right down past <coughs> South Station, almost a dry dock. So I know where it is. Sort of on top the of the tunnel. Convention center? Yeah. Okay. And uh, it's the neurological convention. <coughs> and I was hoping that the electrical bunch from Chicago was coming, but they're not, David. I was hoping to meet them. The electrical bunch? The, the guys in, in Chicago that are studying electrical injuries. Oh, oh, oh. Of which oh, yeah, I have a prime been, example. That would have been, yeah, you and Benny. Me and Benny. Yes. Wow. Um, Hmm. This furniture lasts very well. It's amazing. The, you know, it just lasts. Watson, no, 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 no. Watson, can Mike? Can you try to give him a toy or something just to distract him? He already ate the toy. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't chew as well as wood. <laughs> He's pretty good at carrying things around in his mouth. <coughs> Any rate, that's all I know. Well, it sounds interesting. It should be interesting. I haven't done it. I see. I used to do these all the time. Yeah. At yeah. least once a week. Yeah. And they usually pay very well. Mm. I mean, when I was doing it professionally, if you, there is such a thing, you, mm. you could make five, six, seven hundred dollars just to bring a bunch of animals into some because you get the attention. I can almost guarantee everybody at this convention will be in our booth. Oh, oh absolutely. <laughs> How many dogs do you bring? Five. Bentley in harness. Grace in harness. Grace. <laughs> Grace in harness? <laughs> what are the Orion in harness? <laughs> okay. And then I'll have. And Orion too? Does Grace count as one or is that. That's two. Okay, that's two. Um, she counts I'm going to have Sizzle in training and then these two puppies just for amusement. Okay. Good. Then everybody can pat the puppies. Oh, absolutely. <coughs> All right. Should be interesting. And uh, lots of. Uh, well, there'll be lots of discussion yeah. about Pat Parkinson's and MS, because oh. we do a lot of it. Oh, that's great. I was going to say a lot of pee pads and pickers and... Yep, all that kind of stuff. <laughs> Towels and... All right, that's awesome. <coughs> okay, woohoo, Katie back on Saturdays. Um, yep. When, where is she going? When is she going to start? I don't know. All right, we'll find out. 
she and Maggie are going to walk around. Walk children, uh, dogs around <laughs> instead of children. <laughs> Leave the children home with the husbands. <laughs> Sounds like a good deal to me. I don't have any water. Would you like a water? I don't think there's any in the box anymore. I think it's in my bed. Okay. Maybe that would be great because I'm getting dry. <coughs> Watson has a wiggle butt too. <laughs> Who does? Watson. Found Watson it. does have a wiggle butt. It worries me because lots of high kitties. These, these, these other ones have a better rear end than he does at the moment. But uh, as Megan points out, Walter was that way when we got him young too. And I think it's because he's been kenneled a lot. See, ours get ours get a lot of exercise. Yeah. And I think exercise cures a lot for everybody except me. So you think that is from I think being in a confined space and having to turn a lot, or, or what? Yeah, it's just not exercise. It's just not exercise. Running up and down Puppy Hill. That's the best thing ever happened to these puppies. Yeah. Well, he sure he needs it, he, but he enjoys it too. He, oh, he enjoys it. it, but his, his rear end just is. It, it's getting there, but he, he hasn't got many muscle in it. You look at her rear end and his. She's, you know, broad hips, you know? Okay, so this is from Paige. Paige. She said, Sorry I couldn't be there to help with milk. I was sorry you're not here. I'm sorry I didn't get to say goodbye to you. But she says, Sorry I didn't get to tell you farewell because you were busy on the phone. Also, I was, what else is new? Um, also, I was having trouble keeping my composure after saying goodbye to the puppies. So far, I've cried in every state I've driven through. Mass, Connecticut, New York, and Pennsylvania. Love you all and miss you already. Thank you, Paige. It was nice to have you and hope, hope you'll come back. Ah, oh, water. Oh. <coughs> You want to know one of my larger problems at the moment? I'm going to find out anyway, so go ahead. <laughs> With this damn thing on, this this heart thing on, I can't I can't have a hot I can't have a heating blanket or a microwave. I mean, I'm really going downhill here. No heating pad. No heating pad. I want a hot water bottle. Uh, I know, but that's not nearly as much fun as a hot blanket. <laughs> All right. Okay. I used to sit here, you know, and I <coughs> heating things on me to keep me from freezing. Yes. You ever thought about solar panels? Where? Here? Yeah. Well, it gets complicated because we're not part of the national grid. Oh, okay. And last time I got all involved in solar panels, it got extremely complicated. I, really? could, I could not cope. Okay. There's just some stuff I can't cope with. The yeah, IRS is, is the other one I can't cope with. Yeah. <laughs> well, you're going to have to cope with them. I'm going to have to cope with them. When um, <laughs> Katie comes out, I'll tell her she has cool. lots of, You have lots of hellos. Blue Penguin says, Penguin hugs and give a kissy face to Milo. Oh, Milo, you have the same And you have lots of other hellos and glad you're coming um, back on Saturday. Is that something you think would be lovely for you to have? Oh, he's got one. Oh, shit, okay. <laughs> okay. He loves his. He loves his thumb. Yes, he does. Hi, Milo. Hi. That's Katie. How are you doing, Milo? <coughs> Ian from Florida purchased my chicken bricks today. Good. <coughs> Bless oh, those chicken yeah, bricks. I Okay, I have some money for you. One of the pups, Ella, has only gained one ounce in each of the two weighing intervals. Will that... Oh, excuse me. Are you? we boring you? No, nah, just you? Keep, keeping me up. <sighs> what would you do to put, help her put on weight? What's the matter now? She only gained an ounce. Ella only gained an ounce. That's Probably had a large bowel movement before we yeah. did it. <laughs> okay. Just like you weigh in a baby. Okay. Keep an eye on her. I'm sure she's fine. It's interesting. You can like weigh them before and after they eat now and see how much they take in. It's really crazy. Yeah. Um, Jane Bow from Halifax says if uh, Watson is so good carrying things in his mouth, why not try the basket? I know. We have to get some sort of control first. We have no control whatsoever. 
the <coughs> poor guy. Although he did, he had learned to use the yuppie. And yeah, that he's is very good at that. Yes. Well, that's just today. Not really? Yes. But he's begin, he just kind of loses his temper. He, he hasn't really thought about it. Oh, I missed. I'm sorry. All right. Um, Oh, anyway, there's Carlene. The conference, can you bring the donation pig? No. No, I don't think at that kind of thing you do that. Yeah. No, we have a table and we yeah. will have the our video going with the cameras. Yeah. Yeah, it's more it's more for an information exchange than anything. Oh boy. How is Sizzle? Does she like Watson and Mindy? Yeah. Yeah, she, she plays heavily with Watson. Yeah, she does. I know. <laughs> he kills him. <laughs> and she's doing fine as well. Linda. Oh, Linda. Uh, thank you. <clears throat> she says, I've lost weight. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <clears throat> yes. Okay, I'm reading now. <laughs> How's her eyesight? <laughs> <laughs> well, they say the cameras make you look thinner, so, you know. Oh. Yeah. I thought it added 10 pounds. I thought it added 40 pounds. Really? Add 10 pounds? That's what I've always yeah. heard. Wow, that's awesome. That means I've really lost weight. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Um, MD Cameron, I just found out on Easter that I'll be a grandma for the first time in November. Nice to see a human baby on the camera. <laughs> Congratulations. That's awesome. That's great. That's great. A human baby. <laughs> but the real test be will, will be Katie when you bring him in and he's walking and you can get him to, you know, meet him. You know. <laughs> I got that one cage down there in front of the. It was with my grandson. Is that right? Right. Yeah. That's where kids go. <laughs> This is just playing too dangerous for anybody. <coughs> he's, he's in the baby hair area, that's the only way. Puck Rescue says, aw, look at Annie with Milo. Yeah. <laughs> oh, uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, God. <coughs> um. yeah, Italian Sarge are probably like, what? Can't stop here. <laughs> I know. Oh, I didn't see Tony before. I would have gone see him. He ran right up to you. Did he? Yeah. <laughs> Right before you came to me. Okay. <laughs> <coughs> Never mind, I guess I saw him. Yeah. <laughs> um, he saw you. Penguin, by nine year, um, will someone post this question for Caroline at the end of mail? Oh, this is Jerry. My nine year old border collie is starting going into Audrey's crate and peeing on the fluffies and pillows that are in there. Any thoughts on why this is happening and what I can do? I leave the crates open all the time except when I'm not home. Border Collie's going in and peeing on Audrey's blankets. I'm trying to think who's who here. The Border Collie, this is, this is Jerry. Jerry, Jerry. Jerry. I'm, 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 I'm getting there, but it takes a while. <laughs> I'm trying to, trying to help. <laughs> Guiding. The Border Collie is going in there and peeing on it. I'm figuring that. <laughs> Why is she not supposed to do that? Shut the door. I well, guess. that's the idea. Yeah. Shut the door. Shut the door. <laughs> Shut the door because, you know, by the time she's peed in there, it's too late to give her hell on the topic because it's too late and she won't know why. You have to catch her in the act. you got to catch her in the act, and if she's hiding in there to go, then <laughs> probably why she's in there. <clears throat> How old is that dog? Nine years old? Nine year old. I think she's jealous. Huh? Jealous? Try, try normal things like, 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 like urinary tract infection or something. She's just okay. trying to hide it. She's probably been going under your bed and things for years. <laughs> <laughs> now she's trying to blame it on Audrey. <laughs> <huh>? <laughs> okay. Rob says Annie's a pro with people puppies too. <laughs> it's okay, Milo. We, you, we're not really calling you a puppy. It's okay. You're a little pup, I guess. People puppy. People puppy. That's great. I like that. Did you go to Laura's school today? No. Were we supposed to? I don't know. If we were, nobody told me. 
<coughs> no, I spread fertilizer today. That was my big excitement. <coughs> it's supposed to rain tonight and tomorrow, and then I will throw seed. Six seeds to the inch. <laughs> I don't even want to know how you count. I don't want to know. Uh, it, you know, it, it, it is just about that. I <coughs> throw a lot of seed. I threw somebody out. I said that to somebody the other day. And I threw some out. And she, oh, jeez, it really about is that. Yeah. yeah, I know you said you... It's just, there, it's just a way of... You start it here, and you let it fly out through your fingers, and it spreads yeah. it all out. And it does, it does, it's good! <coughs> oh, don't do that. Oh, now I got two boxes of Kleenex. All right. Feast of Famine. What? Two boxes of Kleenex. Okay. I think we're about done. Okay. Any more questions at all? I can't get the Kleenex out of the box. Oh, there we go. I got one. I got one. I got it. I got it. You need a Kleenex extractor. No. Oh boy. Is there a tool for that? No more questions. All right. And a one, and a two, and uh, thank you boys and girls. We're done for the evening. Done for the evening. And the guest house wondered if you could come down with the golf cart to bring food up. Yes, I will go down. Well, that sounds good. Did they cook that stuff? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, there's roast, the roast, potatoes, green beans, fresh green beans, wow. snaps, then everything Ooh. I buy on the <laughs> Wow. Really Night all. Night all. If I can figure out how to...